This week's recipe for roasted red pepper and asparagus with a medley of rice is so helpful and so delicious. I hope you'll give it a try. When we're thinking of buying asparagus in the store, it's a good idea to look for asparagus tips that are closed tight. They haven't started to open. It shouldn't look dried and wrinkly. It should look as fresh as possible, of course. Now, when you get it home, rinse it off real well, and then all you need to do is snap the bottom off. And when you break the asparagus apart, it will break off the end that's kind of tough and doesn't taste very good at the right spot. So, just snap and you've got your asparagus ready to go. Now, in the All New Square Foot Gardening Cookbook, Mel Bartholomew says that it's best to store asparagus after you broke off the ends. Then you can wrap the bottom in some damp paper towels and store it in a large zip top bag. Or you can stand the asparagus up in a glass or a jar of water and then loosely cover the top with another plastic bag. And that's what Mel Bartholomew recommends. Great suggestions for storing asparagus and then use it within a couple days after it's in the refrigerator. You'll also need a red pepper for this recipe in four pieces. It's so easy to do when you look at the red pepper as a box with four sides. Take your chef's knife and just cut those four sides off and you'll leave all the seeds and the stem part of the pepper right in the middle. I usually take the end off too and use that. Now when you've slathered the asparagus and the red pepper with some olive oil, it really is a generous amount of olive oil you'll discover. And once, it's, once the asparagus is fork tender, then the red pepper will be perfectly done at the same time. So as soon as they're cool to the touch, chop them up. One other thing that I was going to show you is how easy it is to use fresh garlic. Take that clove of garlic, smash it with your chef's knife, and then the peel will just come right off and it's ready to mince up. So this is so easy to prepare. Cook your rice, have it ready to go, roast the vegetables. It's good at room temperature. And if you're thinking about growing some asparagus, which I am, Mel Bartholomew says in his square foot gardening method, just one root system of asparagus per square foot. And within two to three years, you'll have a wonderful harvest. I know it's gonna be hard to wait that long, isn't it? Do give this recipe a try. It's just a great springtime side dish. I'm Sue Doden and I'm all about food.